people as you can see from behind me you see candles so we're about to do my long-awaited candle collection video i just took everything out of the crates and just kind of laid everything out so everything behind me is like in a swear so um before i get started um those that are new welcome my name is tasha and i created this channel for all things my best life i do a lot of trader joe's hauls now i'm kind of gonna get into the bath and body works candles this the candles are my thing especially from bath and body works um and just you know all things my best life story times i gotta get that incorporated too but before i get started i just want to give you guys a little background about why i even started collecting candles to begin with so summer of 17 i remember going into bath and body works and they was semi-annual sale during the summer and i got two candles they were french lavender and i came home and i burnt them and they were garbage hard garbage and it kind of just put me off afterwards it just kind of put me off so the more i, I continued to watch youtube i saw all these other youtubers that just raved about these <clears throat> bath and body works candles so i said you know what i'm gonna try this again and i did i went to the winter semi-annual sale and that's all she wrote so this is probably my collection from december of 2017 and it just kind of turned it kind of morphed into what it is now um I don't even know how many candles I have, so I'll probably just count them and then put the total in the in the comment box or in the description box below. Um, speaking of which, guys, sus subscribe. And I believe it's right here. So like, comment, and subscribe. Um, here's my shirt for this morning, <laughs> meh, because that's how I'm feeling. But um, I'm gonna be behind the camera this time and then just, uh, work it out that way so i will um see you guys shortly peace okay so let's get started so this is like the first wall of stuff do you like my uh my candle or not candle that's my um damn what do you call it my wallflower the little hamsa but this kind of goes across this one and I'll just go ahead and uh, just talk about them all briefly. So the Roma candle, yeah, Roma. That's the pizza candle. That is a unique fragrance. I got that 75% off. Island Papaya, Dream Big, which I believe is, I don't know that one, but those are the notes on it, but it smells good. Peppermint Marshmallow, Thailand, that was from the Destinations collection, and I haven't burnt it yet, but that smells amazing. Lemon Mint Leaf, Red Velvet Cupcake. So this Lavender and Pine I got from Tina Marie. Hey girl! I got it off Macari, and um, I love a good lavender scent. To This Tahitian Coconut, is amazing and you'll see several of those in the collection this i think i got several of these paris cafes they're okay lemon lavender shortbread it's probably one of my favorites for the for the spring and summertime and I have a bunch of empties. I think I have about 10 or 11 empties upstairs that I'm going to go talk about as well. Um, and vanilla pumpkin marshmallow is part of that. Um, it just has a very light, almost a kind of a weak throw. Let's see, that's mahogany teak wood. Another gather. Oh, another, I told y'all, you're going to see a, probably a few of these. My, so, London is my favorite city in the entire world. 
honestly, I should have brought bought a whole bunch more, but you know, I'm not even gonna burn this one. This is just for me. This is no kidding. I'm just gonna keep this until they make another one, if they even make one. Okay, so Gold Digger. These are the notes on here. So it's Midnight Blue Citrus. Again, you guys are going to see some more um, Tahitian coconuts. So that's, that is this portion. So that's that side. Okay, I am back with the second part on the other side of my basement. Gooey marshmallow. I love a good marshmallow scent. My absolute favorite candle of all time is Marshmallow Fireside. And you'll see a lot of those. I don't think there's any on this side, but I love a good marshmallow scent. This cinnamon. Caramel swirl, this scent after you burn it will probably last in your house, oh my gosh, like two, three days. That's a good one. Hot butter rum. Raspberry peach macaron. Macaron. You got to get that R's back there like the French. Oh, macaron. <laughs> All right, so I got here salted chocolate caramel unicorn sprinkles okay so this let it snow because i've checked this these two are the twisted peppermint i got those at my first semi-annual the winter of 2017 that into the night is a sexy lady just get that just get it another lavender marshmallow this black tie you're gonna see a lot of those as well too that's the sexy man so you have the sexy man and the sexy lady just get those that's a good combo together i always think of like new year's or something like that to burn that it just is a good time for it again so this this london is a tea and biscuits it's not the um it's not the tea and lemon that I just showed previously, but it still smells just as good. That New York is rose water and ivy. The somebody loves you is marshmallow fluff. You gotta have this in your collection. Just yeah, you gotta have that. This blessed is pumpkin pecan waffles. Okay. So this party dress is, um, was it two? I think it was two candle sales, candle day sales ago, but this was a hot one. That and French baguette, which I have too. But I got, I, this was the last one they had and I was able to get it. And, um, you know, it's, it's another sexy lady candle. This whisk, we wish you a Merry Christmas. I have two of these. This is maple cinnamon pancakes, and I really enjoy this. I mean, I love the packaging, and I'm a baker. And, um, yeah, it's a really, really, really good scent. This campsite coffee, so I'm not really too big on Paris Cafe, but that campsite coffee is fire. Y'all need to get that. Champagne toast. This bad boy, I believe, yeah, sweater weather. And I heard that this love candle, Rose of Vanilla, is going to be discontinued, but I have a lot of those, so I'm glad I got them when I did. That sugared lemon zest is, um, it smells great on cold, but it has a, um, a pretty weak throw. Mahogany coconut, that's a sexy summer candle. Another black tie. Marble toffee. I really, really enjoy that one. And this Ski Lodge. Um, I think that's Land of Sweets collection. I got a lot of those at 75% off. Uh, actually, this winter. So we're done with this side. And I'm going to make my way to the other side. And we'll be done. So we're on the final side. Um, you guys saw the sexy lady candle earlier. 
sexy summer candle. Again, this is one of my favorites for the summer. I don't even know how many black ties I bought last winter. I think I bought like, uh, <laughs> oh my gosh, six of them. That's how much I love black tie. Wow, Poppy, that's okay. It has a good, it has a decent throw. I was burning that one in the summer. So this bad boy, I didn't turn it around right, but this is New York. That's cherry cheesecake from I think again, Land of Sweets collection. And I try to get a different marshmallow fireside like every year in a different like packaging. I just picked these up um, at the buy one, get one free sale a few days ago. I love y'all marshmallow fire. Y'all already know. Tuxedo night. I know that's another sexy man candle, but let me see the notes on this one. It smells delicious. I know that. And I know I bought it at a candle day sale and I don't think I've burned it since I got it. This is from candle day as well. This day classy is black tie. And I got this um, at the winter, so 17. So it was the winter of 17. And you know what? I probably should have known then that I was going to have a love for a black tie. Maple, blueberry maple pancake. So I actually bought this one right here that you see at the buy one, get one free. So I burnt the last one. My history with blueberry maple pancakes is that it can turn very like, it smells super plasticky at the end and that performed great. So I went and got another one because I really enjoyed it. And I didn't know I got another one. It's probably good that I, that I start doing these candle collections so I can see what I have. Gold Digger is, oh, which one is that one? I thought it was, wait, didn't we just show, I think I showed y'all that one. Yeah, it's Midnight Blue Citrus. Winter, that is, uh, that candle is great. Super great. Tina Divalit. Tina Devalicious put me on to this one. So thank you for that. This thank you, I have no idea what the name of this candle is, but those are the notes on that one. And we're coming to the end, guys. I wanted to make this quick and efficient as possible. That French baguette was a super duper popular one. Um, I got that from Candle Day as well with the party dress. And... Um, I'm not, I'm pretty sure I won't burn that one either. And then we have um, winter and ice cran apple. So this is the whole collection guys. I want to keep it like super quick and efficient. I really hope you guys enjoy this. My plan is to do this every six months to a year. And it's kind of good to know what I have. And um, I do repurpose a lot of these candles throughout the year as gifts, especially around Christmas time and end of the year teacher gifts. And um, yeah, so guys, again, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.